Good morning, guys. Well, it's morning at the time that I'm recording. Can you guys see the peacock way over there? It's beautiful. Sorry about the squinting, but I'm over here in a very, it's, it's early morning like I said, but I'm over here in a very uh, non-interesting part where there's a lot of sun. <laughs> I'm at the parking lot of the Arboretum here in Arcadia, but right up there, somewhere there is the peacock. It is just beautiful. You see it? Beautiful. All right, so we're going to explore the botanical gardens here, the Arboretum here in Arcadia a little bit. Uh, I wanted to get out of the house and try and see what I can photograph, what I can photograph, uh, especially as we get closer to spring. I think spring is the 21st or the 22nd, so, of March. So it'll be nice. Technically, I don't think they open until 9 here, though, so I'm just a few minutes off. Oh my gosh, another peacock. I'm so impressed, but they're literally like everywhere here. Oh, did you see it? Flew up. There's another one somewhere up in that tree. I can hear it, but I can't see it. See, the peacocks are like, there's another one right there somewhere. They're like really beautiful looking birds, but my gosh, they sound terrible. They sound like, I don't know, they sound like they're gonna kill you or something. <laughs> wow, it's so beautiful here. I haven't been here since I was a kid. Oh, you know, we're still doing maintenance at this hour. It is pretty early in the day, so understandable. All right, we're gonna go through the Madagascar Spiny Forest. See what we find. That is one sick looking plant. Definitely got spines on there. See them? They're really tiny, but there they are. This guy definitely has got spines. Spikes, actually, all over. Thorns. With regards to, wait, let me find shade. All right, so obviously nobody likes thorns on plants, but I remember this one time as a kid, we were at a party and it was a family party and there was a water hose that we needed to use, so to get to it, you had to go through this bush, and I didn't know that that bush had thorns. And when I tried to reach for the faucet to open it up, I got, I got pricked really, really bad. Like, it went in really deep, like right in between my finger and my thumb, right? Uh, it was uncool. I was traumatized for a long time to touch any plant that had some kind of a spike on it, um, but, uh, I tread them with caution now, but I do admire them a lot, so it's really nice to get to see this, but uh, yeah, I tread with caution. <laughs> oh, check out the thorns on this guy. Yikes. Now those are some thorns. Alright, so another one of the reasons why I'm at the Arboretum here is because there has been a huge amount of rain here in California and because of all that rain it's attracted so many butterflies and the butterflies are attracted to all the flowers that have bloomed in season so I'm trying to see if there are any really beautiful flowers or anything here that I can find and 
try and capture some of that because California is so random. Who knows if next time, you know, next winter or springtime, if there will be as much rain as we've had this season. So I'm um, trying to get as much of it in as possible. I don't know if you guys can hear this sound, but one of the most iconic things for me about coming to this place was the, um, the waterfall that they have here. It's not huge, but it was my first waterfall experience and it's always been memorable to me, so we're approaching that. This is it, my childhood waterfall, my first waterfall experience. Smaller than I remember, but it's still beautiful to me. Yeah, that's really beautiful down there. Just looks cool. This whole area is so beautiful. I'm so glad I came. All right, everyone. Well, I'm keeping this video a little bit shorter than usual. Uh, just wanted to bring you guys along on this little adventure that I wanted to take today. And uh, hope you guys enjoyed it. And don't forget to like, subscribe, share this video, comment down below. Let me know if uh, you've ever visited the Arboretum here in Arcadia or if you think it's a place that you would like to visit. Uh, personally, I recommend it a lot. So if you ever have a chance to come down, please do come down with your family and enjoy the day. Um, if you are planning though to do commercial shoots and stuff like that, you do have to have a permit as is probably per usual in places like this, but just heads up. But all right, you guys, thanks so much for watching. Catch you on the next video. Until then, see you then.